So is it okay to have fun in this town? <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, For the world today, Auschwitz, of course, is the symbol of the Holocaust, and many people forget that the city is here. Many people don't probably even know that the city is here, and that's why people who live here are quite sensitive about namings. Oświęcim is the town with today around 40,000 people living, and Auschwitz is the camp. The kind of idea about, uh, about this town was that this should be the ideal Nazi town. For some people, it's a surprise that, uh, that there was such rich Jewish history in the town next to Auschwitz, because for many people when they come here, they really see this area as you know, kind of a black hole. There is nothing here that this happened, that Auschwitz happened in the end of the world. Whether you're asking me if the town of Oświęcim deserves a concert with a rock stars, yes it does. So I see no problem and I think a wise educational use of this neighborhood, of these two realities that must coexist, can benefit both the festival, the audience, and our educational role that we all have. I was born in Auschwitz, which is a beautiful town. People also work hard here and have fun, the same as in the rest of the world, except they live in the shadow of history. I was thinking about the appropriate tool to use in this modern world as a platform to reach out to as many people as possible. The answer to someone who also happens to be a music radio journalist was that it should be through culture, music and art, the language that crosses all borders. Come on, I mean, you know, 65 years ago, uh, the things that went down in this place uh, for us as uh, Jews uh, is so ugly and so uh, horrible that we feel very privileged today to come here and celebrate life with, with the new generation. The reason the festival is happening on this land in Auschwitz is uh, kind of like uh, big finger to the past, maybe. Before moving forward, I need to know, is anyone in here speaks Hebrew? Every piece of land on earth, I think, is... Uh, soaked with blood. Yeah, it is. It's soaked with blood and violence and terrible things that were happening on it. But at the same moment, the, with a lot of great things and great love that was inspired on this piece of earth. I think as a German band or as Germans to play here, it's, it's kind of um, it's it's a very meaningful experience for us because we are um, branded. You know, when you grow up in Germany, you are always branded with uh, things that happen in Auschwitz. You know, we, we must somehow move on. You know, we can't just hold on to history because otherwise we're just not going to progress. And generations move and things change. And I guess we are here to celebrate. The, you know, the future and the possibility of, of a much better planet. I guess that's what we're here for.